uh, they understand that there's youngsters around them. Everybody's coaching with us and helping with us. So we'll make that call on, on Sunday night uh, after the Bulls game uh, internally. And yeah, we'll announce a captain for Wales. But then when we announce the Irish squad after that, you know, obviously we'll announce. Um the Springboks head coach, Racy Erasmus, has revealed his three men shortlist to captain the team in the upcoming test match against Wales at Twickenham Stadium and has updated his stance on Sia Golisi's future in the role. Golisi will miss the clash against Warren Gatlin's charges due to club commitments with Racing 92 and the match being outside the official international window, meaning that someone will have to fill the void for the first test of the year. Erasmus, speaking at a press conference on Thursday, confirmed the contenders for the role and clarified that the decision on the longer term Springbok's captain will be made before the island series. He said, inside the camp, the captaincy is not really such a big thing. Obviously, the long-term and permanent captain is still a thing, but this week it's not a big concern as we go into Wales' test match without Sia. But it will probably be Peter Steph Dwight, Ben Edspen, or Bongim Bonambi. The above-mentioned trio have all captained at the Springboks previously. Detroit doing so only once and also against Wales in Erasmus' first test match in charge of the side back in 2018. As Beth as the most senior of the trio, having been there 13 times while Mbonambi led the team against Argentina and Romania last year. Erasmus added that Mbonambi might not get the role as he may feature on the bench with Malcolm Max set to make his return to action having been sidelined since the Rugby World Cup pool stage match against Scotland last year and said we might want to start Malcolm to manage his game time. We will do that because if Bongi goes down in the first 10 minutes, Malcolm doesn't have to play it 70. The box head coach confirmed that the captain will be announced internally on Sunday night following the Bulls United Rugby Championship semi-final against Leinster. Erasmus added that Colisi will obviously be in the running for the captaincy after leading the Springboks to back-to-back -to -back World Cup triumphs. Doubts has risen about his future in the leadership role following his move to Racing 92 after the World Cup, with Erasmus admitting that he prefers his captain to be based locally. However, he reiterated again that Colisi could still captain the side and said, once Sia is back, we can assess him and make sure there are no injuries and is at full fitness. Then we will make a decision on the long-term captaincy. We have two weeks after the Wales Test match before we face Ireland. When we announce the squad for Ireland Test, we will announce the captain and a guy like Sia will be in the running if everything goes well and he is injury-free. Please like, comment, share and subscribe for more sports news.